Alrighty, guys. It is Thursday, the 13th of May. I'm going to be tackling Deep Sea Diving by Oragox, which I've already played. I have a gold medal already on this track. I found this one interesting. This this is what I played instead of under construction, like, like what was yesterday. So I know that this is a dirt track that has some nice scenery of an under an undersea drive. I named the author medal, but I know that my time was pretty good. So I'm going to have an improvement. Play against my followers. Who played Trackmania today? I'm going to be having some nice, fun, uh, deep sea experiences where we don't get out, actually. So. Um, is my followers? Hey, I'm okay with that. Opponents from North America. Okay. This seems, it's weird that it did that. Drive alone. I don't need that many ghosts. Okay. I gotta get used to this track again. Oh my god. Yeah, this is a dirt track with... This is a high-speed dirt track. The blue theme. Oh boy. It's uh, okay, actually. Make this loop. You gotta be careful of this. Oh my god. Okay, maybe I go a little bit higher there. <clears throat> I think this one's gonna be a hard one. I didn't go too hard into the into trying to grind it, but I did definitely, you know, improved a few times in a row. That was nice, that was smooth. We're gonna have to get some wiggles in here. Go really high on this so that I might come back down. This good. I lost a lot of speed there. Don't hit the plants! I knew I was gonna hit the plants. Going super smooth on this intro. I'm gonna wiggle like crazy. Any opportunity I get. Oh my god. We've got a very fun one today. Wow, that was extremely close. Get some wiggles going. That was very close as well. Into the looping. I do a very long speed slide. I have way more speed coming out of that because I, I had a very different exit angle. Yeah, it seems like there's a there's a line I can take through that corner that gets me significantly more speed. Oh, I touched the wall. I've got to make it so that I get 
I gotta at least get a better time than my previous time. Go deep into this so I don't miss making it. Get a nice wiggle going. Go really high on this. Okay, so yeah, going really high on that is definitely something that I can improve, and that's probably where I'm gonna need a lot of my time. I kept a lot of speed out of there. Get the wiggles going. Oh, I have a lot of speed, and then I had to, like, lose it all in the end there. I definitely could have carried more speed there. I can generally get, it seems like, around once, uh, like, I can end with 60. If I get, like, 460 here, I'm super fast. This is slow. Okay, I, could, I was getting massive speed, but I forgot that I can't... I have to turn a little bit harder. Here's where I get good speed. That was almost a 470 run, which is quite a lot of speed. Just from some minor speed slides. You can see how far it's kind of launched me. I was just trying, I was, I'm, I'm trying to optimize so hard for just like a good, huge amount of speed. And that wasn't as bad, or that wasn't as good as last time, but it was still quite a lot of speed. Getting a clean set of landings is definitely helping. lose a lot of speed going this high. Oh, I kept so much speed. Oh, this is going to be improvement. Yes. Let's go. I almost choked in the end there. It was uh, really close. Holy... I don't know how close I was to the edge there. I'm going to save that replay just in case I get anything better. 53.6. Oh my god, we're close to... 0 0.3 away. Oh, that's a lot though. I was doing some mega optimization there. I don't know how much... What is the... Let me figure out... Okay, I have to actually make it to the GPS. I'm going to see... What is the GPS time? Oh yeah, I forgot. This is how the GPS is. Take a splash into the water. It doesn't want to tell me what the GPS time is. There's three GPSs. We need that. It's not going to help me if the GPS doesn't... If I don't have what the GPS time is. Because I want to know... If it's good, what I need to do, you know, I need to be ready to follow it. 
or learn from what it's doing to follow it. I would hope the author metal is similar to the GPS, but there's no way for me to know. Oh my god. Oh, 469, let's go. Okay, I'm trying too hard to just like smoothly slide. That was not good speed wise. I have a lot more speed here, holy, my exit. I had a, a much different, I had a much more different line. No! Oh my god. So I definitely want to go. It seems more on the outside there. Four seventy, that's really good. I feel like this is slow, but I do have what looks like more speed. I mean, that was not going anywhere, but it was a good lesson in optimization. We're 70 again, that's really good. That was good. Uh, I was gaining on myself. My speed slide at the end wasn't good. of speed there. Well, I'm surprised I didn't get air. Oh, <laughs> I was I was neck and neck with myself to the end. This track is costing. This track is causing me to concentrate very hard. I'm sorry for the lack of commentary, but boy, is this track just like getting me into the focus mode. Okay. I did that loop somehow better. Sad that I wasn't able to follow it through, but... Four sixty eight, pretty good.
There you go again, having a better loop. And then I slammed into the corner. Crazy. Sixty-nine, but then I wiggled, so not good. Probably wiggle on that down slope. Okay, don't do that. Bad. Bad for your health. Four seventy, let's go. And then I touch the sand, so all that extra speed goes away. And I just decided that I wanted to take every corner deep on the inside. Oh, I almost hit the checkpoint. Okay, that's super slow. I mean, we're gonna go for it, because practice is better than no practice. <laughs> I really need to take that corner wider. Under the sea. And such. Okay, I was too high there. Four sixty nine. Oh, I gotta slow down from clipping the corner there, and then I hit the jackpot. Okay, you know I was gonna be scared if that was a continuation because, well, it meant that I was gonna maybe lose some time where I shouldn't have. It didn't matter. No. No. <laughs> that was really good. Why? <laughs> Getting this per- Oh, 471. It's about- Like I said, I was getting this pretty perfectly. Did the loop worse, apparently. Oh my god. I was coming down that pretty straight, and I was like, and I, I foresaw that I might hit that corner and did everything I could to possibly avoid it, but alas, I was unable to do so. Here we go again. Did the loop somehow better? The loop makes no sense to me. Sometimes I can just gain speed for what seems like no reason. Oh, I was <laughs> I, I was so confused. I mispressed both of my steering buttons. This track makes a lot of use in my in my usage of this. Or in my line of this track, makes use of a lot of my other buttons that like semi press the controller. I lost a whole bunch of time in that loop somehow. Yeah, see? I was point two at the checkpoint before the loop, and then I lost it all in the loop. That's annoying. But, whatever, I guess. Fine. We still got 10 minutes, I can make something up. 
I know that if I follow with myself and then somehow get a better loop, I don't know how that will happen, but somehow get a better loop, I can at least, you know, improve. Ugh. I was wondering how this, like, really big half loop, or like quarter loop worked, and then I saw, but it's just the, uh, it's just the, like, wall ride pieces. I don't know why I didn't think of that sooner, because that, that makes the most sense. I was like, is there just a custom block that's, like, a bigger partial loop? No, it's just used wall riding pieces. Because they're already exactly that. You can rotate blocks in, in any orientation, so... What's it matter if... if by default, it's, like, sideways? Oh, I do a lot of that section with my, like, three-quarters steering. Oh, I got a small amount of air. This is probably not going to be much. But it will be practice for later. Okay. Or not. No. Didn't even see what speed I was at. It felt fast, though. No, go down! Oh, okay. I have to get down fast, otherwise I stay up and potentially either get air or have a horrible entry into what comes. At the checkpoint. I feel like that deep inside line that I do there is what I want to do. I do it here. No, I was too late. That was really good. I had like point one on myself. Okay, go low there. It seems is the strategy. Yeah. No, I was too late again. I think I have a strategy for the loop, though. This will probably get me the off metal. I just have to make sure I actually can get it. Need a good. I just need an okay run. Can make the loop like super good. That was like perfect. And I clipped, so a little bit of that perfect speed got lost. I go deeper here. Yeah. Definitely have that loop figured out. And I lost a whole bunch of speed there. Catching back up. There it is. Wait, no! Oh my god, it's not! I, I lost a- I, well, I, can't, I lost the same amount of speed that I did in the loop again. What is that loop?
What did I do the first time to get the loop so fast? I barely made the loop to begin with. So I'm surprised that I did something that I was able to do what I thought was a bad thing twice. Didn't feel like I made the same mistake twice. Just felt like I took the loop. I'm absolutely... This is insane. The, uh, like, alternation that I'm doing between my two buttons. Because I cannot press them at the same time, otherwise I start steering in the opposite direction. I lost a whole bunch of speed there. What the heck? This is a non-improvement again. What the heck? I just had three runs in a row that were nearly the same. When I'm gaining 0.2 in the loop. I don't know what happened here. Okay, glad it ended. Eh, not the greatest speed-wise, but... I get down early. Extremely early. And I have quite a lot more speed here. I can launch myself into the loop. Do my loop nicely. Oh my god. Alright, I'm back. But I am trying to assess my situation. I don't remember where I am. I'm just coming out of the loop. Yeah. <gasps> no! <laughs> I made the wrong decision to hold left. Or right. Alright. Probably only have a few more runs. But now my time is desynced, and so I have no idea how long the video is. Because right now is 30 minutes. But... It's not probably the case. I'm gonna keep going here for maybe another two minutes or so, and then we'll call it. Hopefully I can get... An, a run where I don't absolutely ruin my end, apparently. I got the 69 speed, and that's nice, so we're already off to a great start. I got way too much air there. I can make up this loop by just annihilating it. Oh, I hit the checkpoint. I was pushing it a little too hard. Want to jump too low or too much? Jumped quite a lot there. Still I'm speedy. Look at this loop fast. Wow, I'm surprised. Lost a lot of speed there. And there. I'm just holding out. I don't know where I gained so much speed in the last time I looped because I, I I was behind and got to see what I did and I wasn't gaining any speed so who knows what happened to gain me so much speed the last time. Super early jump into a very early loop. See how much I rocket forward in the loop? Just, just from my, like, revised strategy. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna have to call it here, though. So, <laughs> I will see you all tomorrow, or Friday, the 14th of May, where we will tackle whatever track happens to be the track of the day for that day. The end of the weekend. Um, until then, I hope you enjoyed the video. 
Um, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. We'll do one final send-off run to see if I can maybe get this down. Already looking pretty good. And that's it. All right. Later.